Side by side, he's gonna hit me. He is, yeah. Son of a bitch. Of course I lose safety points. What's up guys, thanks for tuning in. Here we are at the Daily Race, the Group 4 around the Kyoto Driving Park. Um, I am racing today in my Audi TT, sitting in a very uncomfortable 17th position. This is the first time riding since the last update came out, so it's interesting to see how the new tyre wear and fuel will take effect, or affect me in this race, I should say. I've noticed that in this particular race, there's a lot more BMW M4s whoa, than there used to be. Very few Megans. I don't know how this TT will handle now uh, with the tyre wear on, with it burn through the front tyres fairly quickly. I got the traction control left on, just for the sake of leaving it on. You don't really need it in this car. But sometimes when you accelerate hard out of corners, you'll start to wheel spin, you'll burn through the front tyres. Off through the S-bends, as smooth as I can. Try and close the gap now on these guys up ahead. I think that's a Megane in front of me. Not the fastest through that corner. I got a guy in behind me, 18th. Only 0.7 of a second off. Try to cut the curbs if I can. Don't go too far off. Okay, closing this gap now on them again. Not close enough to try and outbreak him on this corner. He turned in very early, which means he's going slow. Couldn't really get on the power as quick as I wanted to without going into the back of him. But I've closed up the gap nicely at least. Is he going to move left on me? I don't know where he is. There he is. Okay. Oh. Trying to get on the power way too soon. Traction control taking over as the wheels start to spin. So I'm pretty confident I can get past this guy and move up to 15th. Or 16th, I mean. And maybe 15th even as well. Oh, he's not too fast. Oh, somebody has spun out. So there we go, up to 16th. This guy's not too fast around the corners. Messed up those corners though. I couldn't see where the curb was when he was right in front of me. Another one of the long corners coming up now. He turned in a bit early. So I'm coming out faster than him again. But I turned a little bit hard, so the front wheel started to lose grip and I lost a little bit of speed. Whoa! Sneak by the two of them. Can I stay out? Oh, I'm getting nudged from behind. Managed to stay on, though. Oh, the Megane closing quickly. Whoa! I knew they were going to do that, the two of them. God damn it, both of them tried to outbreak me and all they did was nudge each other. So I had nowhere to go. So back down to 16th I go then. Hopefully these two idiots will take each other out. And I can get past. Oh guys, come on, get the hell out of the way. And the Megane a little bit faster down the straight. But this guy in the kind of dark grey Megane messes up another flying corner like he's done the last few laps. Might be able to get around him. Mm, can I? Can I squeeze through? Side by side, he's gonna hit me. He is, yeah. Son of a bitch. Of course I lose safety points. Whoa! That BMW coming up fast, I just managed to get out of his way. 
on the meta balls of that corner. Looks like somebody else went off. Sneak past him. Try to close the gap now on these two McGann's again. Looks like that guy there sitting 13, 14, 15. He messed something up. Might turn in a little bit late for that corner. But it's not too bad, I still got out alright. The M4 going up the inside of the Megan up in front of me. And I messed up that corner because I was concentrating on the cars in front. They notice the cornering kind of starting to go with the front wheels. Almost no wear on the back tires. But a quarter of it down the front already. On the M4, kind of bashes his way past them again. squeeze past side by side he's hitting me again where the hell is he there he is so he goes wide I managed to sneak out in front of him I have a feeling I'm gonna get hit from behind on this corner though no I kind of Went a bit slow to the corner. He came in quite fast, but at least I didn't get rammed from behind. Okay, sitting in 14th, but I still have a pit stop I need to do. A half a tank left. On fuel, but it's not so much the fuel I'm worried about. It's more the tires. If I can't accelerate or get take corners properly, all I'm gonna start doing is losing time on people. But if I pit too early, then I'll have to worry about that problem again at the end of the race. Oh, up the inside again, and he hits me. Yeah, this guy's a dirty son of a bitch. I get a five second penalty if he smashes me off the road. Whoa! This guy behind me going crazy. Hitting the barriers as well. So I had a time penalty to get rid of, but I've also got a pit stop to do, so I'm going to do that now at the end of this lap. on the tires now. So this guy here in the M4 is coming up fast behind me. Side by side into this corner is not the way you want to be. got through with that fast in the night that I could not break enough or turn enough. Let them pass now. I go in for the pit. Oh, this guy in the McGann is going in at the same time as I am. Great. 3.2 laps of fuel. I only really need five. On the money. 
Well, actually, I only needed four of that uh, worth of fuel. Whoa! Almost taking out that TT there. Oops. I don't know if I got out ahead of that McGann, did I? Was that him up ahead? I know he was German. Is that him sitting in 14th? So I'm down to 18th now. Maybe he got out a little bit quicker. I really should have only taken four laps worth of fuel, not five. Or am I working it out wrong in my head? Screw it, it doesn't matter. Oh, Reagan way too late, and I couldn't turn in. Still have that time penalty I need to get rid of as well. Usually it'll just start to trickle down. Oh, it's gone up to 8 seconds. Why has it gone up to 8 seconds? I hardly met up any time while I was in the bloody grass. I didn't cut the corner. I went wide on the corner. God damn it. Try and close the gap on the guys of ahead regardless. Sitting second to last. There's one guy in the pits. I'm passing him. Thirty one seconds off lead. Huge gap. Wonder is the BMW M4 the car of choice now? As the front wheel drive cars just eat through tires. way too late on those corners and I just can't make the turn in so that's costing me every single time trying to accelerate late out of the corner start scrubbing off a little bit of that time penalty that's easy to do it on this track. Not that it's gonna make a hell of a lot of difference. Whoa! The guy behind me in the M4 trying to force his way through. I wasn't even looking in the mirror, I didn't realize he was so close behind me. Closing the gap at all in the cars in front. 2.2 seconds off. Oh, I mess up the S bends. I'm looking at the time instead of the road. So I'm up to 2.5 now. I'm at a balls of the corner and the shifting. So I've got this black BMW right on me. Coming into a tight corner that you got to break hard for. Finally, they can go wide on the brakes a lot earlier than I was the last few times. Completely ignoring the cones. I can't break that late in this car. Still kind of holding off on that BMW behind me, at least. Not particularly fast through there, either. I'm 
Oh, I'm pulling away again. Whatever the hell I did that last lap that it could catch me so easily. Not great on that corner again. Not really making any ground on these guys up ahead either. Shifting down to third this time. Maybe I'll check that corner a lot faster. Looks like I'm knocking a chunk of time off these guys ahead because there's that Graham again, the German guy. Holding up this guy in the blue M4. So as he's getting in everybody's way, I am to close the gap on them. And can I knock another two positions off? Still got seven seconds of a time penalty to try and get rid of. And there's only a lap and a bit left. I finally can get past that McGann. And I need to get rid of this time penalty. Like, oh, typical. And it's not going down. Okay. Great. That's why they let them pass me for nothing. See, holding the lead against them isn't going to do any good anyway. Because I have, I've got such a huge time penalty on my... Okay, there we go. Oh, I might as well have just gotten rid of it. They would have knocked me back on the standings anyway. Can I at least hold off the ass place? Whoa. Getting nudged from behind. When he could have easily passed me. He carried way more speed out of that corner than I did. Son of a bitch. Uh, at least I stayed on the road. He didn't knock me off. My front right tire really suffering. can't turn it all. And he just carries all that speed through the grass. Makes perfect sense. Ah! Well, we finished anyway. Ran out of bloody time. <laughs> uh. So that's it, guys. Thanks for watching my horrible and horrendous 19th position finish. It just wasn't working out for me at all in this race with that McGann getting in the way and just ramming me all over the place. And then my tyres running out and then I pit stopped and I was sitting in the pits too long because I took on too much fuel and then I lost more positions. <sighs> so anyway, thanks for watching. If you want to like the video, like it. If you want to comment on the video, comment. And if you want to see more Grand Turismo content, please consider subscribing to the channel.